Yeah. I'm very confused now. I've got no idea, basically, who is going to win. The women's gift. Lauren Bowden's the favourite. She was most impressive. She's on the back mark in the red. Then Sophie Taylor, the Victorian champion in the white. Melanie Perkis in the blue. Whiteman yellow. Hilditch in green. Howard the pink. Downs in black. And Letton is the outmarker in the grey. Lauren Bowden absolutely flew over the top in her semi-final. Hey! She's giving away a big start. She got off to a good start, Bowden over on the outside. Downs and Letton commence quickly. The yellow Whiteman coming through strongly. Now the pink Melissa Howard has taken over. Lauren Bowden has got too much ground to make up. Melissa Howard is clear and she's going to win. Lauren Bowden flashed home to get second. Sophie Taylor was third, but 24-year-old Melissa Howard from 9.5 metres takes out the state of Victoria Strickland family women's gift. That's a bit of a surprise. Lauren Bowden had the fastest time in the semi-finals, but Melissa Howard, trained by Ryan Hoffman, who's a multiple semi-finalist here, medical receptionist from Queensland, Beach Flags champion. Again. It's uh, good form. Have a look at her start. She bursts from the blocks, as you have to do on the beach, but she's got really good technique, and Paul Crycroft Wilson, similar sort of style, burst out of the blocks and very confident. Of course, from that outmark, she used it well. She was able to hang on. Bowden was flying home, but couldn't quite get there. And, well, they share the same coach, Paul Crackcroft Wilson and Melissa Howard. So that's uh, good form, mm. Peter. And, well, boy, the squad. They've already got a winner at Central Park on Easter Tuesday. Yeah, perhaps an omen going towards the Australia Post store gift a little bit later on. Lauren ran really well from her mark of 3.75 metres, but just ran out of ground in the end. Melissa Howard is the winner of the women's gift in 2011. Koza. Yes, thanks very much, boys. Melissa is still gaining the breath. What a win for you. Congratulations. Oh, how exciting. I'm just trying to get my breath back in. I just wanted to have a good start and try and get down that field as fast as I can. And the, the field in here is just amazing. And to get up, it's, it's a good thing. <laughs> you've, you've won other championships on the beach. What does the work in the sand do for your legs here on the grass? Um, it gives us a good, good start on the grass. I think most of our training's on the grass. And um, I think all, all round working on the grass is probably the best for you. And um, to get up, it's just amazing. And all our other guys that are competing here, like my coach Ryan Hoffman, I'd like to thank him. Paul Crowcroft Wilson's coming up in the final. He's my partner and I hope him all the best too. All right, you'll be nervous for him, you think? Oh, I was so nervous in the semi, so hopefully there's no heart attacks in the final. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well done, Melissa, congratulations. Thank you. Is it going to be the first of a big double for the stable? Melissa Howard wins the state of Victoria Strickland family women's gift in 13.94. Lauren Bowden flying home to get second, 14.07. Sophie Taylor in third, 14.10 after the women's gift final of 2011. And from the sprinters, we go to the milers. When we come back after the break, the race they call the Herb. The invitation over the mile coming up at Central Park in our coverage of the 2011 Australia Post store gift.